This video is an introduction to the three other videos on this YouTube playlist, the playlist entitled In Honor of Yervant Terzian. Yervant is the David C. Duncan Professor in the Physical Sciences at Cornell University. And on October 10th of 2009, after a dinner at the Statler Hotel on the Cornell campus, a number of birthday tributes were delivered to Yervant in the form of short talks by colleagues on the Cornell faculty, uh, scientists from other universities, former students, and others, including myself. Uh, I was scheduled to be the 13th speaker of a long list of speakers. And as the other speakers uh, finished their talks, I became nervous about both the length of my talk, because the proceedings were running quite long, and the fact that some of what I had intended to say was largely redundant based on what earlier speakers had said. And so I attempted to ad-lib a shortened version of my talk, which I'm afraid didn't work out that well, and also resulted in my doing less than fair justice to the tribute to Yervant that Barbara had prepared in the form of a dance, which I was supposed to be introducing. And my consternation was great when, in addition to that, the projection of the video of this dance that Barbara had done was botched both because the sound didn't come out right and the resolution on the large screen was much less than we had hoped for. In any case, we've now decided to post our own tributes on this playlist, um, and uh, let me say something about each of the other three videos. Uh, the second is my tribute, much abridged from what it would have been on October 10th, or as Blaise Pascal probably would have said, since I had more time, I made it shorter. Um, yeah, among other things, it does provide, uh, I hope, a clear explanation of why Barbara thought that she owed Yervant her own personal tribute, uh, which is the, the third of the four videos. This is a dance she choreographed and performed to a song called The Galaxy Song. Uh, the Galaxy Song is um, highly astronomical and was uh, both written and performed in a 1983 film called The Meaning of Life by Eric Idle of the Monty Python comedy troupe. Um, the astronomical information with which it's loaded is, I'm told by a member of the Cornell Astronomy Department, accurate as far as it goes, but the real art of the song is the way it's woven together, uh, something like the Gilbert and, Patter, uh, Gilbert and Sullivan Patter song. The performance of the song that Barbara used is not Eric Idle's, but a uh, performance by Clint Black, an American country singer, and she utilizes only the first two of three verses of the song. Uh, the song itself is quite charming, as I said, and so as the fourth and last of the videos on this playlist, we've included a, a clip from the original film with Eric Idle's performance of the song, All Three Verses. I hope you'll have time to watch some or all of these videos, and Yervant, our hats, my Cornell cap, is off to you.